My name is Zixu Zhang. I'm pleased to present our RSS 2021 paper, Safe Occlusion Aware Upon Driving by Game Cinematic Active Perception. Occlusions are ubiquitous in our daily driving scenarios when buildings, landscape, and other traffic participants limit our ability to see the road ahead. Autonomous vehicles face similar challenges with occlusion because their onboard systems rely heavily on line of sight sensors such as cameras, radars, and lidars to detect objects and make decisions. Occlusion limits their perception ability and leads challenges in safe navigation. Recent approaches use over-approximate forward reachable sets to predict potential objects in occluded regions and plan trajectories to avoid intersection with these forward reachable sets. Although this method provides strong safety guarantees, it's overly conservative in many cases. For example, let's consider an autonomous vehicle following a slow-moving truck and trying to overtake safely. Based on the current field of view, the forward reachable set grows and quickly occupies the entire oncoming lane. Therefore, the vehicle will never attempt to overtake. As we can see, this type of approach only uses the information available at the time of planning. It ignores the vehicle's future ability to sense and react to the presence of currently unseen objects. Instead, we formed the problem as a dynamic pursuit evasion game with two phases, each having a different information structure. In the first phase, the autonomous vehicle, acting as an evader, cannot observe the potential object, which in the worst case will act as a malicious pursuer with full information. In this phase, the evader is forced to use overlooked strategies which cannot adapt to the pursuer's unknown position. However, if the pursuer ever enters the evader's field of view, the game transitions into the second phase, in which both agents have perfect information of each other's states and apply optimal close-loop feedback strategies based on their observations. The evader will lose this game if the pursuer enters the danger zone, from which constraint violation or collision is inevitable for the evader. The danger zone and the evasive strategy are encoded by a well-known Hamilton-Jacobi Isaac equation and can be approximated through a variety of methods. Therefore, by finding a closed-loop strategy to keep the pursuer away from the danger zone, the evader can maintain safety indefinitely in the closed-loop game. However, under a collusion, neither the existence of hidden pursuer nor its state is known to the evader. Therefore, the perfect information assumption for the closed-loop game no longer holds. The key question here are how do we represent those hidden pursuers, and what is the safety criteria under our collusions? First, consider the evader have some initial belief of potential hidden pursuer. Given a candidate trajectory for the evader, we can use the reachability analysis to obtain a set of states that the pursuer can reach from the initial belief without violating its own constraint or being discovered by the evader along its trajectory. We refer this reach a voice set as pursuer's fault hidden set. The safety threat comes when a new object is first detected. If the object already enters the danger zone, the collision may be inevitable for the evader. From the above observation, we can formally present our safety criteria as shown in series one. In short, the evader always needs to avoid constraint violation and make sure the forward hidden set and danger zone are disjoint. Once new objects are detected, the evader's collision avoidance strategies are immediately available through the closed-loop pursuit evasion game. This safety criteria can be applied to many risky horizon planning algorithms to plan an open-loop trajectory game against potential hidden objects. Consider the truck overtaking example again. Assuming the planning algorithm wants to expand two separate trajectories towards B and C from point A, we first optimistically predict the evader's field of view when it arrives at waypoint A by assuming no objects have been discovered so far. Then, we can estimate the forward hidden set based on the predict field of view and calculate the danger zone for the evader when it moves from point A to B. In this example, since the danger zone and the forward hidden set are not destroyed, our safety check fails and this subtrajectory is discarded. We can repeat this process for waypoint C. As the forward hidden set does not intersect with danger zone, so the evader can safely move from A to C. Moreover, if any future subtrajectories are proposed from this waypoint, we can apply the same procedure to predict the field of view and check the safety. After expanding the trajectory to a waypoint C, the predicted field of view covers the entire oncoming lane. Therefore, it's very likely that we will find a safe overtaking trajectory later on. We further demonstrate our framework using Kala Simulator. By predicting the field of view during planning, the trajectory game encourages the Eagle agent to explore and gain visibility explicitly. Such actions improve efficiency and allow us to overtake the truck in this example. Even when an object shows up during overtaking, the hybrid game will still assure safety as the evil agent immediately switches to the closed loop game and aborts the overtaking. In this example, the evil vehicle drives through a blind intersection without collision with another vehicle emerging from the occlusion. If another vehicle enters the intersection early, the evil vehicle is able to slow down and yield to that vehicle when necessary. Once the road is clear, it then proceeds to the intersection safely. In contrast, the method proposed by previous work frequently cause the autonomous vehicle to freeze before the intersection. In summary, we propose a novel occlusion-aware trajectory planning framework using a hybrid zero-sum game. We provide the safety guarantee through our game's dramatic analysis and minimize the conservativeness by accounting vehicles' future sensing and reaction ability. This framework is agnostic to driving scenarios and suitable for various trajectory planners. Thanks for your time, and please check out our website for more details.